The following is a special presentation of Miami All Access powered by the Miami University Bookstore. Not just a bookstore, the bookstore. Hi, my name is Joy Mavanga. I'm a senior from Indianapolis, Indiana, and play for the men's basketball team. Uh, the most prominent uh, artist on my iPod is probably uh, the artist known as Lil Wayne. Uh, he's got like 10 different names, but that's probably the artist that's most prominent on my iPod. Uh, my favorite pastime is probably nap taking. Uh, I was actually thinking uh, just a few weeks ago if they had an Olympic team for taking naps, I'd probably uh, quit basketball and give it a try because I'm pretty good at taking naps. And it's probably my favorite thing to do. Favorite midnight snack? Uh, I mean, I've came a long way. It used to be pizza, but with, over the years, I try to uh, you know eat healthier and everything. So uh, if I if I had to say something that I eat at midnight, and I kid you not, it's probably fruit or beef jerky. Uh, my favorite childhood toy, man, I had so many. I, I probably like cars, like just toy cars from the little Matchbox cars, uh, all the way up until the remote control cars. I went crazy over those. Uh, the best vacation I ever took, I, I can't really think of one that just really sticks out. I remember playing basketball in high school. We went to Vegas. That, that was a lot of fun. Obviously, I was only like 16, so it wasn't that much fun when I think about it. But here in about, uh, let me see, like three, four weeks, I'll be going to London, and that should be a nice little fun experience, so I'm pretty excited for it. The person that inspires me most is probably my mother. Uh, uh, everything, uh, my, my mom. Uh, it, she's just a really hardworking woman. Uh, I could remember there were times when I was growing up younger, she was working three jobs. And it'd be like she'd come back from one job. And, uh, sorry, Mom, I have to tell everybody, used to work at Walmart. But she used to work at Walmart, come back from that job. Uh, she'd study for school, and she's just, like, just her work ethic is amazing. And uh, she's such a selfless person. She's always worried about everyone else. And uh, so basically, I, you know, I just try to model myself after her because uh, off the court, just try to be a good person. And on the court, just try to have a really good hard work ethic. Other than playing professional basketball, I, th I really think I want to get into coaching. Uh, I, my uh, childhood, childhood and growing up, uh, just a lot of people that inspired me. I only started playing basketball when I was a freshman in high school. And just the development that I was able to get through people that really cared for me on and off the court and that helped me get better, uh, you know, th those people really put, made an impact in my life. and uh, I feel like if I was a coach, uh, I feel like I have a personality that would enable me to be able to help other young men that were trying to you know, get better at the sport. Uh, uh, thank you for spending a few minutes listening uh, about what I do in my life. Uh, hopefully we'll see you at a few basketball games this year. Go Redhawks.